So I just finished cleaning up my office a little bit and I wanted to head and hit some balls in the indoor driving range. But first, let's make some coffee. We didn't park our cars in the garage last night. So, I got my clubs right there. No cars. And then... So it looks like we got a little shoveling to do today. So let's get to it. What we can be Live with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited for So we got everything wrapped up with shoveling, cleaning up all the snow that we got last night. And so now I can finally head to the dome and hit some balls, work on a few things that I've been thinking about with my swing. And it's New Year's here coming up. So uh, looking forward to kind of putting in some of these uh, new swing changes for 2019. So as you can tell, I just wrapped up at the dome. I was hitting some balls, rolling a few putts. A lot of people in Alaska kind of just put the clubs away for the winter time and wait for the spring to pop back up to start swinging again. But that was kind of my whole goal this winter was to not take a break, keep swinging every week, a few times a week if I can, keep the swing somewhat familiar so when I roll into spring next year, I'll be very comfortable with where I'm at. So right now I feel like I'm on pace for that and it's things like this hitting into a hundred yard driving range essentially is not always exciting, but sometimes it's necessary. So hope you enjoyed this little look into the day in the life of golf in Alaska, especially in the winter. Uh, this is Knox Golf. As always, like, comment, subscribe. 
you have any questions, shoot them below. Let me know if you struggle with golf in the winter as well. So thanks for tuning in again, and I'll see you guys next time.